Hey, what's up? Join me for a wine tasting of this Triana Cabernet Sauvignon 2017. This is from California Central Coast, uh, the Paso Robos region. And it's a place where it's weather is warm, it's by the sea, got a sea breeze, soil is nice. So um, this is supposed to be a really nice wine and uh, it's by Austin Hope, which is a very famous winery. And but it's like this is like a secondary line that they came up with. So I, again, I'm gonna open it and do a first impression and let it uh, breathe for a while and come back and see. So I'm just using my grab it here again. All right. I'm scared. Oh, this is a hard one. Boom. Come on, you wanna come up? Uh, you're so close. You're so close. Oh, can you hear that? It's like that. So let's see. Cork is like that. No writing. Oh, writing is on the top. Okay, Triana. Uh, let's pour it a bit out first and then wait. I have a new wine glass. Uh, it's by Zhao To Zhao Zhao To. Uh, Austria wine glass. Okay, let's see. Ooh. Let's do more. Okay. Wow. Wow. Okay, let's give it a minute and I'll read. I'll see what's say what it says on the back. Um, growing up with his family's vineyards, Austin Hope has spent much of his life around Cabernet Sauvignon. Excellent, because I like Cabernet Sauvignon. Three individuals, Austin father Chuck Hope and his uncle Paul and winemaker Chuck Wagner, help guide his path. Blah, blah, blah. It's 14.5% alcohol. And um, I think there is a little bit of other grape in there too. It's mostly Cabernet Sauvignon. It's mixed with a little bit of other grape like Merlot, Petit Fidol. And, okay, let's nose it. Oh, wow. It's quite berry and a little bit of oak oaky i can smell it i can smell the oak guys all right let's do it let's give it a first impression cheers mm. oh it's very nice already guys i i like it so i think this is a wine again that you can drink right away don't have to wait much longer you can open and drink sometimes some wine you better give it like a good 45 minutes to an hour to breathe but wow this one is nice okay let's have a a bit more. Um, first impression, I can I think it's quite um like coffee and chocolatey, chocolatey is that word? Um, but I really like it. It's like smoky coffee and kind of like chocolate and rich, which um body is full, full body and it's quite smooth. I really like it. All right, and those are my first notes. And I'm gonna let it sit for a little bit and I'll come back to it and we will drink more. Brb. Okay, so it's been about an hour and I'm back and let's see how this Triana tastes like. So the smell is quite smoky. I, I really like that. Okay, cheers. Mmm. Mmm. It's not that different from an hour ago when I first opened it, but definitely a little bit easier to drink now because the alcohol content, the alcohol flavor evaporate, like, like it's gone now. And it's not that different. And I, I still can taste the chocolate and the coffee flavor from it. Let's have more. Mm. It's very chocolate, yeah. Chocolate and coffee. Oh, mocha. Chocolate and coffee. Mocha, nice. Yeah, so it's like mocha. Um, at the end, it's like a little bit of spicy, actually. Like the aftertaste is a little bit spicy and the berry flavor come out at the end and it's like spice berry. Does it make sense? <laughs> so yeah, I quite like this and it's quite full body and smooth. Um, not not sweet not not too not too sweet yeah smoky is what i think is is the the number one description of it and it's also quite oaky like i can the aftertaste i can also like the spice and the berry and then i can also feel the oak it's probably has been aged in an oak barrel for for part of its lifetime so yeah i like this cool yeah so this is a tri the triana 2017 paso Paso Robos, uh, Central California region. Cool. I'm gonna enjoy this now, so bye. <laughs> Drink wine, and I'll see you in my next one. I'm gonna take off and enjoy this right now. Peace.